Hi everybody, my name is Dr. Howard Cohn and I'm a licensed doctor of chiropractic and I've spent the last 20 years in practice uh, in the fields of natural and alternative health care with a lot of time spent in nutrition, the field of nutrition. And I got to tell you, in our office, we've gone through over the last 20 years probably over 10,000 nutritional products that we've either tested, used, shared, uh, part of formulating, you name it. And uh, I got to tell you, I have never seen a product like the product I'm about to tell you about now. The name of that product is called Amgenix. Amgenix is the first product of its type. There's so many different things I can tell you about. I'm going to tell you the three main things that when I heard it, I was like, you're kidding me, all in one product? I've never seen that before. So a lot of us know, you know, if you're a baby boomer like me, the one thing you want to do is you want to not get old. We want to do everything we can to not age. And we've heard about these things called antioxidants. What does that mean? Oxidizing means it's like our body gets old. It's kind of rust, like, you know, your car rusts. And an antioxidant would be something that stops or slows down that rusting process. So, and a lot of people say, well, I've heard about fruits and vegetables, certain things. There's certain superfruits out there, the acai berry. It sounds really good. Lean Camu sounds good. That's Camu, Camu, uh, Noni, of all these different things. And so in Amgenics, the first thing they did was they realized that these antioxidants uh, have value. These are actually what's called secondary antioxidants. And what they did was rather than say, oh, we should pick this fruit or pick that fruit and, and, and put that and have that as our product, they put them all in one. There's actually over 20 different ingredients of these certain what's called superfruits. And that's the base. That's just the base of what's in Amgenix. The second thing is probably the most uh, uh, pivotal thing, and there's a new category in the field of uh, nutrition, and it's called epigenetics. In fact, it's such a new and such a breakthrough category that it warranted being on the cover of Time Magazine in February of uh, 2010. And uh, on the cover, and what they talked about epigenetics, they were talking about our genes, okay? And let me just kind of give you a little metaphor about genetics. Genetics is kind of like what we call a loaded gun. So just because there's a bullet in the chamber doesn't mean it's going to fire, which means just because my mom or my dad or my grandma or my grandma had, a grandpa had some kind of certain health challenge or some kind of uh, disease or whatever doesn't mean I'm automatically going to have it. It means that I might have a tendency for it if I do what they do, expose myself to the same stressors that they have, uh, do, eat the certain ways, and take care of my body the way they did. I, that stacks the cards in that favor. Well, in epigenetics, they have identified there are certain foods, actual foods that have properties that have the ability to turn on our genes that protect us from firing these abnormal genetics. One such food is broccoli. And in broccoli, not just broccoli, broccoli sprouts, there's an ingredient called sulforaphane. And there's been all kinds of different clinical studies on sulforaphane. What sulforaphane does is it turns on, it's been documented to turn on over 200 genes within our cells that are responsible to protect our cells. They're responsible for detoxifying our cells, controlling inflammation, and cellular protection, protecting us, keeping us from what we talked about, oxidizing. So uh, that is a breakthrough because a lot of t one of the things that it does is so many things that it does, but it turns on within our cell a element called glutathione. Okay, what is glutathione? You may not have heard about it. A lot of people haven't heard about it. It is what's called a primary antioxidant. And a lot of people try and take it in pills and capsules, IVs, all kinds of stuff, and it gets eaten up in the digestive tract. Our body does not utilize it. Well, what happens is it turns out that the way to actually get it the best is to actually turn it on or switch it on within our cells. And sulforaphane from the broccoli sprouts is able to do that. And that is a principle, one of the principal ingredients in Amgenics. If that wasn't enough, the next thing, and the thing about this company that made Amgenics, Omega Global, they are the leader in the, uh, what we call the self-care movement. And the future of medicine, as I've seen, and if you've heard anything, is going to be in the, in, in the area of energy wellness. And they have these, this product, not just the ingredients that we've talked about, but it's actually zero-point energized. It actually goes in a amized fusion chamber, which was created by this company and a group of scientists that, that put this together, where a frequency is embedded in this product. So not only are we getting the superfood antioxidants, not only are we getting the primary antioxidant of glutathione switching on our cellular protection, but we're also having it energized so our body is, we, goes to this perfect state of balance from the zero-point energy resonance inside our cells. 
inside our body. So we have this in, from the inside out. Listen, I don't know about you. Uh, we talk about genetics. My mom sadly died of cancer. My father died of a heart attack. Uh, I am a loaded gun. I have two bullets in the chamber. The number one, kid, number one and two killers in America are cancer and heart disease. So in China, they say, don't wait too thirsty to dig a well. It's a lot easier to stay well than it is to have to get well. And that makes sense to me. And I don't want to go down that same route that my parents have. That's why each and every day, my, my, not just myself, but my family, my two daughters, we all take uh, Amgenics. And I highly, highly recommend that you do the same for yourself and your family.